More on the Rena House decision, but we begin with this breaking story. A CTA bus in a fast food restaurant. Let's get right to our Dana Koslop live there at the scene. Dana. Eric and Brad, that is the back of that CTA bus. It's lit up right now, and that is the back of the KFC restaurant. Right there next to it, of course, a CTA tow truck, the red truck there, getting ready any minute, we believe, to tow that bus. Again, we expect that is going to happen any minute. Now, this incident happened around 7.15 tonight. The bus jumping the curb, plowing over a street sign, and then hitting the back of the restaurant's wall. Amazingly, it did not break through the wall, but the damage to the front of the bus is pretty extensive. Chicago police tell me the bus driver suffered some sort of medical emergency, lost control, and then slammed into the restaurant, which was open at the time. The drive through is still open. He was taken to the hospital, condition unknown. Other than taking out that street sign and hitting a bike, there were mangled parts of the bike at the scene. The bus missed light poles and several trees along the side of the street before hitting that KFC. Now, police say no one else was injured, which is pretty amazing if you consider what happened here tonight. It is not clear how many people might have been on the bus. If any, we are still trying to get that information. Again, the driver's condition unknown. I am live at Western and Roosevelt. Dana Kozlov, CBS2 News.